everybody, this is Catherine, your favorite French Canadian. Today I'm going to show you how to improve your performance uh, slash FPS to Island of Nine. Uh, right now you don't have a lot of option uh, in this game. For sure you can change all uh, your uh, uh, graphic option in the game, but I will show you where are the config file. So to find a config file, you need to go to your main drive, users, uh, the name of your computer, app data, local, ion branch, save, config, Windows Note Editor, and after that you will look at game user setting. So for now, you have all those options uh, in the game, but probably in the future, scalability here, you will have other options, maybe in Gene 2. Uh, the game is in alpha right now, so we will see. That's why I'm showing right now uh, the config file, because maybe with some patch, uh, they, they will add like a new graphic option or new stuff that you can enable or disable. So let's go back here. So this game is not well optimized right now, you, you will see. Um, the first thing that you need to remove is shadow quality. Make sure that you're putting zero over there. Uh, for each bracket, two to one to zero, you will gain four to six FPS depending on your video card. So when you put shadow to quality at zero, you will see an increase of 10 to 12 FPS. So pretty good here. Also foliage, make sure that you're putting zero. Same thing here uh, with the foliage. It's a bit like shadow, but you will gain a, le a little bit less FPS. It will be 3 to 4, 2 to 3, depending on your card. So at the end, uh, if you put it at 0, you will gain maybe 7 to 9 FPS. So still a decent improvement over there. Uh, after that, um, the texture quality, don't touch it. Uh, maybe just if you don't have a lot of RAM on your video card. For example, if you have 2 gig of VRAM, maybe you should lower it. But honestly, at 2, you will be okay. Uh, effect quality and post process quality put one over there you will gain three to four fps for each one the only thing with these two is you will see a big decrease uh, decrease in the uh, image quality uh, effect in the game etc so for me foliage and shadow it's not something very important when you play a competitive but post process quality and effect it's always nice and uh, nice to have uh, same thing with anti-aliasing make sure that you're putting one because to its 2i, you will lose too much FPS, and 0, uh, the image quality is pretty bad, so just stay at 1. Uh, view distance quality, depending on whatever your rig, if you have your 60 FPS right now, just stay at 2, because view distance quality is kind of nice, you want to see far, it's a battle royale, so you want to know where your opening are, but uh, if you're, you don't have your uh, 60 FPS, go with 1 over there, and look at your number of FPS, and worst case scenario, go to 0. Uh, last resort, resolution quality, so this one you're at 100, 100 is the default, you can downscale your resolution if you want, put like something like 90, but over there you will see a big decrease in your image quality, this is last resort. So that's about it guys, uh, if you have um, any question, post me your rig, so CPU, GPU and RAM, and I will try to help the best that I can. And uh, probably when they release more patches and more options, I will do another video to show you guys how can we really like uh, improve our performance without just decreasing uh, graphic quality. So that's about it, guys. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and peace.